In this video, we're going to look at balanced forces. What we're going to cover is measuring force, the units that we use for measuring force and the instrument that we measure force with, balanced forces, what they are and what they mean for motion, unbalanced forces, what they are and what they mean for motion, and a specific type of force called normal force. Measuring forces. When we measure force, we do it in a unit called Newtons. They're named after Sir Isaac Newton, who's the first person to describe gravity and how it works. And we use an instrument called a spring balance, which measures a pulling force in Newtons. And different colours of spring balance correspond to different scales. Balanced forces. Just because an object is still or not moving doesn't mean that there aren't forces acting on it. So, if we look at the example that we looked in the last video of the rugby scrum, both teams are pushing towards each other at the same time, so in opposite directions at the same time. And if they apply the same amount of force, those two forces will cancel each other out and therefore there'll be no movement. So although there is force pushing in both directions, there is no net force. And net force is when you add both of them together and they cancel each other out. When this happens, we call it balanced. Another example is here pulling on this trolley. You can see on the right hand side, the two red figures are pulling on the trolley and pulling with a force of 100 newtons. And on the left hand side, there's two blue figures pulling with a force of 100 newtons. So because we have 100 newtons to the right and 100 newtons to the left, the sum of those forces cancels each other out and we end up with zero net force. This means that the trolley is not going to move. Unbalanced forces occur when force is applied unevenly to an object. So in this example, you can see that we still on the right hand side have our two small red figures, but now on the left hand side we have a small figure and a big figure. So rather than pulling at 100 newtons as the blue figures on the left hand side were before, they're now pulling at 200 newtons. So when we add these forces together, we find that there is a net force of 100 newtons moving to the left, which means that this trolley will move to the left as if it had 100 newtons of force on it. The force of the red is counteracted by the force of the blue figures. Now we're going to talk about a specific type of force called normal force. Normal force acts at right angles to a plane or like a desk or the ground or a slide and it counteracts weight force. Weight force is the force caused by gravity pulling down on an object. So normal force counteracts that to stop that object moving uh, down, whether it's through the table or through the ground or wherever but keeps it, counteracts it to mean that there is no net force. This is a little bit hard to get your head around normal force because it's not a force that we can actually see. And the normal force changes with the weight force. The more weight force uh, you put on the table, the more normal force the table will put back until of course you get to a point where the table can no longer hold that much weight and it snaps in half. So a good way to visualize this is this book on a ruler. So again the weight force is pulling the book down and the normal force is pulling the book up. And unlike the table where you can't actually see any effect of that weight force, in the ruler you can actually see the bend in the ruler and that shows that that weight force is acting on the ruler and it's providing a force backwards or up against the gravity. Okay, so in this video, we've looked at measuring force, how we measure force, so the instrument we use to measure force, and the units in which we measure force, balanced forces, when two equal forces in opposite directions cancel each other out, causing no net force, and unbalanced forces, where you have uneven forces working in opposite directions, so the net force causes movement. 
And we looked at normal force, which is the force that counteracts weight force and holds objects up and stops them from falling.